For today's dissection, we'll look at the mustard family, the Brassicaceae. This is a cosmopolitan plant family, mostly abundant in the northern hemisphere, especially in the Mediterranean. It includes many weeds, ornamentals, and the commonly known flavorings that are derived from the mustard oils. Mustard and horseradish are prominent spices in this group, but also some food crops such as broccoli, cabbage, radish, and others. In our northern flora, it includes many arctic and alpine species. The entire genome of the model species Arabidopsis thaliana has now been sequenced. The flowers are diagnostic for this family. There are four clawed petals and they are arranged in a cross-like fashion and that's where the old name for the family Cruciferi comes from. Flowers in this family are commonly white, yellow, or pale blue lavender. There are four distinct sepals seen here in green-yellow subtending the white petals. When we're dissecting flowers, the first step is to remove the sepals. So it's you can think about it a little bit like peeling an onion. You're taking the outer skin off and then you get to the goodies inside. Here we see the lyre-leafed rock crest with the four sepals removed. Once the sepals are removed, we continuing to removing the four white petals. Note that the petals are clawed. You can see this here in the upper right hand corner. There, the petals are narrowing towards the base, so it's um, called a claw. And here I'm removing the six stamens. There's four long stamens and two short stamens. The two shorter ones are inserted at a lower whorl, and then the four longer stamens are inserted in a subsequent whorl. Um, I'm trying to um, get these all off the flower and then put them to the side so we can count them. And as you can see, these are um, very tiny and also um, somewhat sticky because there's actually uh, nectar, there's a, a nectary at the base of the um, pistil and that's um, why those are a little sticky. And now here you can uh, see the um, six stamens. There's four long ones and two shorter ones also depicted here in this diagrams are all the floral parts. The four sepals on the left in yellow, four petals in white on the right, and then the ovary with the six stamens, the two shorter ones at the base, and then the four long ones surrounding the pistil that ends in the stigma. This stamen arrangement with two short ones and four long stamens is characteristic of the Brassicaceae family, the mustard family, and is called tetradynamous stamens. The mustard family is also characterized by two distinct fruit types. One that is longer than it is broad, it's called a salik or the second type is a silicle that is wider than long and these two fruit types can seen here can be seen here in this diagram as well as the general overview of the flower composition as well the fruit of the brassicaceae is also unique in that it has a central structure where the seeds are attached that remain after the two valves on the sides fall off. This particular structure is called the replum and it occurs in both, both fruit types, the silic and the silicone.
looking back at the rock crest at the lower left hand flower here what do you think does it have a silique or a silical for a fruit